Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marisa. If it's your first time here, welcome. Thank you so much for joining me today. I know you guys haven't seen my face in a while, but today's a really special day. Today is the day I do my Ode to Markiplier video. And for one minute, I just want to this message is going directly out to Mark. I know there's a very slim chance of you seeing this, Mark, but this is really important for me to say. Um, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for the past six years. I have been watching you. I know your uh, channel has been around for, I believe, eight years now. And I just want to thank you for you being you. Um, Thank you for your creativity. Thank you for your dedication to your community I am, that I am a part of. Thank you for your hard work on all your videos. Thank you for a heist with Markiplier. Thank you for a date with Markiplier. I've never seen a video like that before. I think they were amazing. Thank you for all of the money you've raised, for all of those wonderful um, charities. Just thank you for you making me laugh every day. Thank you for scaring the hell out of me. Thank you for making me cry uh, with all your videos, with your, you know, your uh, goal videos of you hitting a million and uh, draw my life. It just made me ball, and that actually is the video that um, grabbed me. I think when you hit a million subscribers, you did that video. So I just want to say thank you. And this video and this painting I've made especially for you as an appreciation of all your hard work. So guys, and Mark, Marky Moon, um, on that note, here is an ode to Marco Plot.
guys I am back so I hope you are enjoying uh, the video so far the beginning half of the video so let's get right into what I am doing for Mr. Marky Moo here okay so in another video of mine I did say that Mark Markiplier loves 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 space he just goes crazy over space um, yeah so and he has played many many video games that have to do with space he just loves it so we're going to do a kind of like a galaxy space inspired painting okay and we're going to this is filthy a lot of uh, paint splatters but that's fine so this is a 16 by 20 canvas okay and today we're going to do an open cup all right so the, all the paint is going to be poured down here and it's, it's going to come out. And I think that's perfect uh, for kind of like a space inspired um, painting. So this is going to be like kind of our background. All right. And then I have another idea. I forgot to bring it up, but I'll get that in a second. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use it yet, but this is something I have done uh, before on, on a um, piece of wood that came with my Primo Flow kit. It was a, a six inch round that may or may not work. I'm not sure yet. Um, but anyway, because it kind of reminds me of a planet. Anyway, so these are the colors we're using. Alrighty. Now the first few, we're not going to mix anything uh, with it. So we got the Artist uh, Loft Violet. We got Primal Flow Magenta, Primal Flow Bubblegum Pink, and we got some Arteza Neon Blue. Okay, and then the rest of them, we are going to mix um, with the Deco Art right here. Okay, so we got Pouring Masters, the Midnight Blue, Grape Jelly, and I'm going to use a little bit of white. Then we also have Sky Blue, and then we have um, the Deco Art Extreme Sheen and Amethyst, and then we have some Deco Art Gloss Enamel in a Silver. Okay, so these we're going to mix with the Deco Art. I haven't used this medium in quite some time. All right, and these uh, will not uh, be mixed with anything. It's going to be poured straight out of the bottle and through the cup over here, okay? But before all that, I'm going to prime the canvas with, uh, this is actually Pouring Masters again, the black, with some U.S. Art Supply Medium. I wanted to kind of use that up. I actually like the effect it gave when I did one of my chakra paintings. Um, with the US Art Supply and the black, I actually like the effect it gave. And if there is some like texture, I don't really mind it because of kind of the subject matter, which is more space. I'm not gonna mind some, um, any, um, if there is any like cracking or texture, that's not gonna bother me because I'm gonna use that to my advantage. But there is, you know, where is it? Here it is, that little round guy down there. I may actually use it and also attach it to the canvas, um, but I am not gonna do that yet. I'm gonna see if I like it or not, because remember, there's another painting that's gonna be going on top. It's gonna be uh, very similar to this guy here. All right, but you'll see that when I uh, do it, it's the same shape canvas. Okay, and we're just going to place it down. Probably more this. Well, I'm going to see. I'm not sure yet. But um, I'm going to just concentrate on this painting first and take it step by step and see how I like it. And then we're going to work on the uh, painting, you know, the oval painting afterwards that, that will be attached to here. Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to go and I'm going to mix my colors and we will get started with the beautiful open cup uh, space inspired painting for Markiplier. All right, I will be back in a minute.
Hey guys, I am back. So I hope you enjoyed uh, this painting, this video. Um, this came out really great. I'm really, really happy with it. It paintings like this always remind me of uh, aerial maps, and uh, my favorite part is this little section here. I think this came out really beautiful. It was nice and easy today. I had more than enough paint. A lot of times with these slightly bigger canvases, I tend to not ahead of time figure out how much paint I need, but that's okay. I add more than enough and I had plenty of drippings because what I did was I took some of the gabachons that I had made with my gabachon mold and excuse my fingers because they're full of paint now. And I may add some 3D elements to this just like I did with this painting right here where I made the little pink gabachon with the um, gold uh, glitter in my uh, cherry blossom painting. Okay, so that is that. Um, I may add this. I actually, I think I made this on the channel using my Prima Flow uh, subscription kit. This very much looks like a planet to me. I may use this in this painting, but I do not know yet. It is an idea. So the next video, I'm going to be working on this canvas. Okay and I'm basically going to be using colors that are very much associated with Mark, uh, Mark's channel and Una's Honest, okay? So uh, go check out um, their channels, okay? They're great channels. Um, even if you're not into gaming, they're a lot of fun. They do a lot of different stuff, uh, especially on Una's Honest. It's not really so much gaming. It is just doing something different every day, learning something new every day, doing something silly, stupid, funny, okay? So I hope you enjoyed the first part to my Ode to Mark Applier, and in the next video we will be working on um, that guy right there, and then after that we're going to be adding some um, elements. We may add this, we're definitely going to attach that, okay? And we definitely gonna attack something funny. All right. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so you never miss one of my videos. Uh, follow me on social media. All my links are below in the description, as well as all the materials I use. And guys, I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.